Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Free Random Games. A series where I find some of the most random games out there on the internet, and I play them for you right here in this video. I can't promise you all that they're gonna be any good, but I can promise you that we're gonna have some fun, so if you guys cool with that, you down with that. Everybody get ready and buckle up, because here we go! <laughs> okay, first game of today's episode is called PS1 Hagrid. It's gonna get scary, Harry. So, Muggle, Perfect, Chosen One, or the difficulty that must not be named. I don't know. I feel like going with that one because I'm feeling a little freaky. My nipples are already hard. What? And it says, F is Lumos, and all four is Adava Kadavra yourself. Nah, I'm good. Hey, yo, Harry, what's up, my dude? Dumbledore asked calmly. You going out for a walk? Which I'm afraid to say is against Roos. I'm leaving. I'm not even going for a walk either. I'm going for a run. Oh, I can't even go for a run? What kind of spell is this shit? Not that you or me would care anyway. But before I can let you out... You need to do me a favor. Why do I sound like Price from Call of Duty? I want you to bring me at least 15 of those green bottles that Dev has put all over the place. Oh, and watch out for Hagrid. He's patrolling the corridors tonight. Don't let him catch you. Now go! So we have to watch out for Hagrid, because he's coming for our booty cheeks, Harry. And I don't care, because I found one bottle already. This is the hardest difficulty. So I gotta find 14 of these green bitches. Hagrid? Yo, Haggy! Where is he? Where's this big bitch? I'm not scared of Hagrid. He should be scared of me. I'm Harry Potter, mate. Harry Potter, Expelliarmus. Okay, let's just keep going. Got that. What? Why can't I go up there? When God in Leviosa. How the fuck do I... Is that... Oh, I thought I saw him. I thought I saw somebody. Oh, no! oh shit! Oh, you big bitch! Go! <laughs> what? I'm back here. Ooh. Give me that. How do I get that? How in the wizard Harry do I get that shit? No! <laughs> he just comes out of nowhere and just grabs cheeks. Uh huh. Bro just gets cheeks. Okay, Agrid. I see you, mate. How do I get those bottles over there? Is he over there? Nah, he ain't about it. 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 Who the fuck? Wait, Dumbledore. Get me my bottles and you can leave. Okay. I'm going to. There's one. Holy shit. Yo, why are the hairs on my neck standing up? Full attention! Go! Whoa! Oh my god! Go, 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 go! Please. Oh fuck. Oh. How did he not see me? What the heck? No way. What does that say? Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? Just go. Oh man, this is creepy. Oh fuck. Oh my god, you big bitch. You big bearded bitch. Okay. What? No! Man, that's not even fair, dude. He wasn't even coming for me that hard. Wait, what? Okay, he's up there. So while he's up there, I go down here. This is so freaking creepy. Oh my god! Whoa! Holy crap! Oh, that scared the hell out of me! You big ass bitch! Bro, my face was right in his freaking tatas. I hate this game, dude. I hate this game and everything that it stands for. Fuck Hagrid. You're a wizard, Harry. Screw you. Nah, he's cool. He a jolly giant. He jolly as hell, but not this time. He kind of weird. He kind of suspect. He's suspect numero uno. Well, oh, there's one. Come on, get that. Get that. Oh my god. Why is it so scary down here? Oh fuck. Oh god. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Oh no. I don't like this one bit. Come on, go, 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 go. Why can't I go? No! Oh, he's stuck. Oh, oh, thank God. Oh, thank not God. Oh, shit. Oh, juked him. 13 out of 15. I am foaming at the mouth right now. Holy shit. I'm like a Doberman. Oh, what? Get up there. Okay. Holy crap. I need that big one up there. How do I get that big bitch? Dumbledore, you're looking at it with the glasses too. How do I get that? Man, this guy. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Okay, 14 out of 15. Oh my god, no! What <laughs> the hell are you looking at, huh? Oh, the 15th one's right there. The heck? Okay, we got 15. He said, get me my bows, and you can leave. Dumbledore, please. <laughs> oh, oh. <sighs> He's never gonna let me leave. <laughs> He's never gonna let me go. 
<laughs> is what I would say if I was a little bitch. Good thing I'm not. All right, let's go. Come on. Dumbledore. Dumbledore. Please. Let me go. Good. Now you may leave, Harry. Leave, 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 leave. How do I leave? Leave. When Guardian. Fuck. How do I go? Oh, it's fading to black. Sorry, I'm an impatient dick. Oh, this dude. Dobby needs it, Harry, sir. They do not understand. Yeah, I've seen Harry Potter movies. I know who these people are. But since Dobby has left them out for his life, it's been rough for Dobby. Dobby had to do really nasty business to feed his family. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, let, let's keep this PG. Dobby knows very little, but even he understands that what Harry Potter has asked for him could get him in real trouble. Dobby needs it, Harry Potter, sir. It's an understand. Just tell me what you want. Like, come on, man. Stop speaking weird. Now listen up, man. Only keep shut if you do me a favor in return. Bring Dobby at least seven of his medicine and Dobby will give Harry Potter so what he desires. Oh shit, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. I just saw that in the corner. What is this? What is that? Crack cocaine? What? No! Come on, man. Hagrid gets you so quick. Like, damn, he's so quick with the shits. It's annoying. All right, get that? How do I get that? That's the thing, right? Syringes. Dobby, come on, man. What you doing with these syringes? Were you filling up in these syringes? I thought they were little daggers. That's how innocent I am, everybody. I thought they were little sores so he could protect himself from the Malfoys. That bitch is coming! Grab it! It's so hard to grab it. Okay, so Hagrid spawns from the castle doors, I think. He better. Or else. I mean, I can't do shit anyway. I can't even protect myself. I'm Harry Potter, man. I stay getting my ass whooped. I'm Harry Punching Bag Potter. Grab this. Come on, he's coming. Isn't he? No, he's not. Yo, Hagrid's a little bitch, Harry. Hagrid a little pussy, Harry. Okay, grab that. Oh, my! Whoa! Go, 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 go. Please. Hagrid? Oh, my God! What is this? Yeah, just go eat Dobby's ass. Get it, get it, get it! Uh, one more, one more. One more for the homie DJ Screw. DJ Screw wouldn't be proud of me, though, for grabbing these syringes. Stay in school, kids, because this shit is ridiculous. It's ridiculous. That's a spell. There's seven. All right, we got seven out of seven. Dobby, please give me whatever I need. I don't even know what you're talking about. Dobby. You are too kind, Harry Potter, sir. Okay, come on. Let's go. Before Hagrid comes, here are the keys of the Slytherin dungeons Harry Potter has requested. Fuck Slytherin, dude. I want to go to Hufflepuff. Oh, I think this is where Slytherin is. It's got to be, yes. Okay, I didn't know Slytherin was over here. Where's my one? Hello? Why is the music all weird? Hagrid? I didn't mean all the things I said when I was talking about your mom. What is this platformer? The fuck? Harry didn't even have to do this shit in the movies. What in the goddamn? Left mouse button to kill. Bro, I'm Harry Potter and I packed that thing on me, my boy. Look at this. Bra, bra, bra. Oh, Harry Potter in the chamber of bullets, my boys. Where do I go? Oh, you want smoke? Oh, boom. Come on, no? You don't want to mess with me. You don't like it when Harry gets scary. No, I'm stuck, everybody. And I can't jump. I promise you I can't jump. I might have to all F for myself. I might have to Adava uh, Davagada. Next thing on today's episode is called See You Soon. I bet you- Whoa, 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 whoa. That was weird. Warning, some may find the contents of the program disturbing. Contains fast flashing images and can potentially trigger seizures for people with photosensitive epilepsy. Wouldn't that be a better thing to show that before you flicker the lights and show that weird ass image? Wouldn't that be better? I don't know, it's kind of like punching someone in the face and it's like, warning, my fist might go into your face. It's kind of like, what? All right, dot, dot, dot. Mm -hmm. Who is it at this time of night? All right. Mom surely gonna pick it up. Mom? Boy, you still live with your mom? Well, looks like I gotta go pick it up myself. Aw, poor you. You have to go pick up the phone. Oh, he is a little kid. All right, little kid. I'm gonna teach you something in terms of being responsible. If nobody else is home, don't pick up the damn phone. What the hell's wrong with you? It's 2022, man. You don't just pick up random phone calls. It's most likely gonna be a scam. But let's see who's calling, huh? Where is all the furniture? You got robbed, my boy? See, that's what happens when you sleep on the job. <laughs> Hello? 
<laughs> oh, now they hung up, huh? <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> what a moron! Hey, what's this? A CD? I was gonna make a joke, but it's way too easy. Way too easy. Play it. <laughs> hmm. Well, gotta play it then. The DVD player should just be below the TV. If you're watching this, it means an emergency has occurred. Why would they randomly give this kid a DVD? Secure yourself in an enclosed room without windows and only one entrance. Do not respond to anyone outside. Zombie apocalypse? I love zombie apocalypses. No matter how human they sound, do not come out to investigate strange sounds or lights. And most importantly, don't let them find you. No, I think the most important thing is to wipe after you shit, but you know what? That's a close second. What? Why should I lock myself? What the hell's wrong? And what did they mean by him? I don't know, my dude. I need to hide. Quickly. Okay. Oh! I am afraid it's too late for that. Why? Whoa. What? What are you- who's too- what? Hey, hey, hold on. Who the hell is that? Mom and Dad? Oh, shit. Somebody got into their guts? Whoa. Oh, I don't like that sound. What in the world? Run. I'm trying. Oh, dude, this is giving me the chills. I can't run. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like that sound. This is not happening, bro. I'm getting the chills, like for real. What the heck? I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that noise. What did he do to my family? Why is this dude stopping and talking? Run and think at the same time, okay? That's how you survive. What did he do to everything? I have no idea what you're talking about. It seems the time for us to face each other has come. Can you just hurry up, Mushroom Head? Jesus, bro. Thanks too much. I have been looking forward to meeting you. What? I have no idea if I'm making any progress. Before we begin, though, let us take care of those irrelevant to our little chats. What? Oh, okay. I mean, I was gonna say, now's not the time to lose one's head, but goddamn. Now, greetings, Robert. Why with the Robert? Always Robert. If you're gonna introduce yourself to me, call me Jay. Put some respect on it, all right? Let, Let us begin. begin. Listen carefully. I, I need, need you. you. You need me? Well, I don't need you. I, I need, need your body. body. Bro, come on, man. I mean, I know I've been dieting for a little bit and I'm making some pretty good progress, but you don't need this body. It's like a five out of 10 right now. I need a vessel. This world, the one I reside in, I am well aware it's not real. Anything done here is meaningless. My purpose is to slaughter. I crave infliction of pain, suffering, and death. Genocide of mere virtual human imitations fulfills this craving only to some extent. My man just learned a bunch of big words and decided to form a sentence. I want more. I want real impact, real terror, real death. Do you understand why you're so crucial? I really don't, but continue. Da, da, da. Let me take over your body. Yes or no? I'm just gonna say yes, because I would like my body taken over. Very well. Just what was expected from you. I am not disappointed. Now. Listen carefully. I shall provide you with instructions. Enter the building at... Um... The hell is that? <laughs> what the hell is this? Okay, so I was kind of freaked out because I thought this was actually a real location. I thought this was actually like my house or something, like some place that I knew or it was around my area, you know, like horny milfs in my area. But I actually Googled it just to make sure. And it actually is a real address. It says Youth Rehabilitation Services Department. Look at that, everybody. That is actually a real spot. That is freaking creepy. It's an abandoned asylum that was once a state of the art facility before devolving into one of the most deadly mental institutions in American history. That is freaking creepy. All right, let's continue. That's actually pretty cool though, that they actually gave real coordinates. It did give me some chills though. It made me stop like playing and just be like, wait, 
hold on a sec. Should I actually be showing this on the screen? Do not look around. Do not hesitate. Inside, you might experience hallucinations. You might hear people talking to you. You might feel things grasp your hands. You might see unimaginable horrors before your eyes. Do not fret. These are mere hallucinations. Nothing more. Inside, everything is ready, waiting for you. I'll take care of everything else. All right. See you soon, Roberts. And that's it. Last game of today's episode is called Out of Sight. We are playing as a girl who is blind, and she can only see through the eyes of her teddy bear. This is a second perspective horror game, and the last second perspective game that I played was actually really well done. I was watching like some film happening through a camera, or I was watching something happening through a camera, and it was actually really cool. So I'm pretty sure this is gonna be cool too. Because there's not that many games that are like second perspective. Well, that's cool that she can see through that. I think I've seen surgeries of people that are blind that actually got like a lens implanted into their eyeballs, I think. And then they can see, but I don't think that they can see the colors that we see. I think it's like in black and white. But don't take my word on that. That's something that I read. I don't even know if it was fact or ass. Press that to place Teddy. Okay. Whoa, she got hops. She got no sight, but instead she got that Bert. Okay, let me pick up Teddy. This is pretty cool. The elevator seems to be turned off. Well, let's get it turned on. Jump. How do I jump? Oh, okay. I have to place Teddy. So that speckle of nut dust is where I put Teddy. So let's go over here. And this is where the second perspective comes in. All right. Okay. The jumping animation is a little weird, but you know what? Who cares? Like, who really cares? I mean, I shouldn't have mentioned it if I don't care. Uh-oh. The heck? What was that? Put that there. And what do you want me to do? Press spacebar to jump. Press E to walk to push pull box. What am I pushing and pulling? I guess I'm just going to go here. And then I'm going to get Teddy. Yeah, Teddy. So with Teddy, I can't actually jump. That's why I had to pull the box. Okay, we have a hook. Let me put that right there real quick. I think I... What is that? Did somebody just come into a room? Who? Who? Why would somebody kill me if they are? I'm just a blind girl. Who kills blind people? Okay, go. Somebody really about to kill a blind girl. Like, Jesus, dude. Okay, we have a key. That's good. And let's jump down. And let's get it, girl. Okay, let's keep going this way. Wait, whoops. Wait, walk by what? To walk back into view. Oh, okay. Just in case we get lost out of the camera. All right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I can raise the teddy bear up. That is so freaking cool, dude. I like that a lot. Like, she raises the teddy bear up so she can get a little bit of height. Ah, I like that. Okay. Where are we going, everybody? I don't think this is a good place to put the teddy bear. I need to put it right here. And you are too short. Wow, way to call me out. Way to expose me, dude. I am going to grab you. I know what to do. Get this and then let's get the box and we're gonna bring it all the way to the fuse box because it called me short for no reason like you think that doesn't offend me okay we pushed it all the way over there let me grab my little teddy this teddy's the real mvp though put you right here very clever game so far i like it it's like a little puzzle game can i make that no you know what i'm not even gonna do it. i'm gonna do it right where i need to yup ba bam Okay, what does that say? Fuse, fuse list. And then the elevator one isn't crossed off. Okay, so I need to find a fuse because I know damn well I don't have one of those. Is somebody over here? Better not be. Better not. Seems like someone's around here trying to sell me something. What? Do it. Okay, I need to find out where the fuse is. Let's see, the vase looks fragile. Okay, I'm pretty sure there's like a fuse in there or something. I got an idea. I got an idea. Where can I put this homie? Wait, um, can I move you? Nope. Okay, let's see if I can do this. Let's grab the box. Yeah, I don't need to walk back into view. I'm doing my thing just fine. Okay, get up there. 
Yeah, <laughs> love the way she jumps. Shit is ridiculous. Okay, and then let's push that off. Fuse, right? Yep, look at that. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Somebody was talking shit. Hold on. Go, Teddy, go. Who was that? Somebody coming down? Oh. Oh, dude, somebody's angry. That was somebody's favorite base. Fuck that. Let's go. Hurry, 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 hurry. Jump up. Ooh. There we go. Elevator time. Somebody's gonna come down, though. They're gonna be like... Look like I'm about to go into the back rooms in that elevator. About a no clip. Is somebody coming? Nah, you're not about that. You're not built like that. Come down here if you're not a little bitch. Oh, you are? Alright, stay up there then. Little bitches, stay up there. Get me out of here. Look, I look like I'm about to go in the back rooms. Honestly. This is, um, what's it called? A dumb waiter? Yeah, it's gotta be. Dumb waiter. Okay, we put Teddy on the hook. And my dude is on the hook, but he's about to be off the hook. Hoo -ah, hoo -ah. Okay. Ah! I like that. Okay, we gotta time it just right. This kind of reminds me of a, a mission in Mass Effect 2. When I'm supposed to, like, chase a guy. I think I'm supposed to keep an eye on him. And then, um, he's moving around and I can't lose sight of him or some shit like that. It kind of reminds me of that. I don't know why. Okay, push the vase off. Is that vase? I guess we keep all our items in vases. Oh, shit! Oh, my God! Oh, God! Oh, I guess I hide over here. Okay, I got it. So, I'm gonna run and then just hide in the corner. Because I don't think that the guy can actually get me. So, let's go and run. Run, 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 run. Grab it. And hide in the corner. What?! I thought I could hide in this corner right here! Pretend you're a shadow. No. Come on, man. You have four eyes and still can't see me? Bro got no sense of style either. He might as well be the dude who's blind. Okay, at least he opened the door. And there wasn't shit inside of the vase. Bro, what is this? Man, good thing she's blind because this shit would make anybody cry. Look at this. Ugh. I hate these walls. Looks like the 1800s. Oh, I need a double lock with the double dams. Okay. Where's this bitch? He's over there. Well, there's a key on the table. Okay, how in the world am I gonna get there? Um, let me see. Can I jump? I can't jump. I can only jump when there's a box. If only there was something to jump on. Oh God, oh God. How did he even see that? Bro got like the peripherals of the gods. All right, let me place the teddy right here. I wonder if I can push this one. What? Mother... Why? Dude, this man's... I swear. I see it. It's that box all the way over there. That is ridiculous, dude. But he's busy working on that thing. What? No! Why? Bro, like I said, she's blind and she's just a little kid. Wow, that painting looks evil. Sorry to change the subject, but look at that man's. If that was somebody's grandpa, if that was my grandpa, fuck. I'd run away. Okay, he's focused on that. He's focused on that. Ah. Okay, that's what I had to do. Wait, do I do this? I have to put him on the hook? And then I have to time it? Shit. Okay, got it. And then I have to flip the switch. All right, let's do this. Come on, let's see who can do it faster. Um, E, 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 E. Should wait for the hook to stop moving. Oh, he is turning around. He looked like he ready to punch somebody in the throat. What is he looking for? Bro, really out here just doing the most with the least. Long arms bastard. And he had a big ass bald spot. No wonder you're mad all the time. Taking it out on little kids. Oh shit. No. All right. So let's wait for him to turn around. Pretend that he's actually picking something up. Even though we clearly can see what he's doing. I think he's just one of those people that, you know, they pretend that they're doing something. And let me wait. Because he turned around last time I was trying to move. So that's the mistake that I made. Look at this dude just pulling off these freaking like holds on these dance moves. He's just like, uh, uh, uh. I can't stop looking at those butt cheeks in that painting. That shit is ridiculous. Some big ass bubble butt cheeks. Some bubble buddies. Let me actually get the bear because I can't even see what the hell I'm doing. I don't even know up from down right now. So you're coming with me, my dude. And we need to get the keys. The keys are right over here, my friend. So I'll place you right here. No, no, don't place you right there, actually. Um, I need to get the teddy bear back. Where am I going to put you? 
Right here? There you go. Okay, at least we have, like, a place where we can put the teddy bear in any direction. He's our camera. He's our cameraman. Or woman. Who knows? Okay. Let's jump up here. There you go. The hops! Oh, shit. My bad. Okay. Got the key. That's one key. And I know we need at least one more. But we saw a place where we can put the box. I think it was, like, somewhere over here? Yeah, 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 yeah. Right there, right there, right there. Okay. So let's put the box all the way past the TV. Pretty sure this is it. I guess I can only hold one item at a time because I was holding it in my hand. So let me actually use it real quick, just in case. Put you right there. And see, I have a key in my right hand. So let's unlock that bad girl. How am I going to get that key right there? I can't even see. Hold on. Um, fuck. Don't tell me I got to put the bear all the way back there. That's tough. What the heck? Okay, I got it. We just have to wait for him to turn around, and then I'm just gonna grab the key, and then we should have enough time. So wait, don't, 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 don't. Oh shit. Grab the key. Okay, close that. Hurry up. Got it. Holy shit. Can't believe we did that. So let's see what is behind this door over here. Oh my. Whoa! Oh. What? Oh, shit, we gotta run. Holy crap. So why is he holding the bear right where I can run? That's, <laughs> that's actually pretty freaking funny. But it's clever, but it's just funny. Okay, jump out the window. That is actually pretty freaking funny. And then she threw it outside. I mean, he threw it outside. This guy is so dumb. <laughs> he threw it outside. I mean, I guess he doesn't know that the teddy bear is the vision for her. But why would he throw the bear at the girl? It's like throwing a pillow at somebody. It's not going to do anything to them. But yeah, everybody, that was out of sight. Second perspective game. I enjoyed that a lot. That one was really cool. I actually enjoyed all the games in today's episode. But that's going to do it for this episode of Free Random Games. Hopefully you all enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure you give it one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude. <laughs>